it's Mindy here from Working Bull with your country music news from the last week. I hope you've all had a really great weekend. I actually took the family down to the Broad Beach Country Music Festival on Sunday. It was really amazing. It was the first time that I had actually been. Uh, there was all these uh, coffee shops and hotels that had music playing in them so you're walking down the street and you're getting pulled in all these different directions from from these great artists playing so it was really good to see this live free event um, I must say um, before then the winds and the rain kind of came through and, and washed us away for sure um, but we are thinking of next week next year heading down and renting a unit because you're right you could be right above the venues playing um, and then just come down and listen to who you want when you want have a walk around when it gets too much just go back have a bit of a time out <laughs> what's my plan anyway um but yeah so i thought let's have a look at what's been happening uh first of all checking out new music for the last week there hasn't actually been a lot go on in this space uh, i i'm thinking it's one because it's a uh, summer over in america at the moment um so therefore a lot of artists are actually out on tour uh therefore not releasing new music in Australia, artists tend to wait until the Gympie Music Muster or further on in the year, the Tamworth um, Music Festival uh, to release their new albums. Plus it's winter, so we don't have a lot of artists out on tour either at the moment. So it is a little bit quiet. The artists who did release new stuff this week includes Brad Paisley and Denny Levito for their release of their new video clip, for Without a Fight, and Brandy Clark also released her new album, Big Day in a Small Town. Now, for those of you who don't know who Brandy Clark is, she is an awesome songwriter who uh, wrote the band Perry's hit, Better Dig 2. She also co-wrote Miranda Lambert's Mama's Broken Heart and Casey Musgrave's Follow Your Arrow. Um, and at the moment, her current single is on CMC Girl Next Door, which is a great song. She also has a new um, single just been released um, called Three Kids and No Husband. Or Three Kids, No Husband. Um, so on this week's top 10, we have Keith Urban remaining at number one. Um, again this week with his album Ripcord. The Wolf Brothers stay at number two with This Crazy Life and they're actually uh, in America at the moment touring so if you are over there in America check them out you will love them. Uh, number three we have the Nashville's number one uh, volume three and then Blake Shelton stays at number four with If I'm Honest. As for artists on tour this week we've got Adam Harvey touring a uh, in Queensland, sorry. Um, he starts in on the Sunshine Coast at the Wombai Pub on Thursday. He then goes up through to Rockhampton and out west uh, and finishing up this week on Sunday night at the Spring Shore, um, which is west of Rocky. Um, definitely in the right state this week with the State of Origin on Wednesday night, which I'm sure the Queenslanders are going to take again this week. <laughs> we also have Ashley Dallas on tour uh, at her regular gig with the West Tamworth Lees Club. Uh, she's on this Saturday night and that one there is also a free event as well. Looking at upcoming festivals, we've got the Birdsville Big Red Bash in about two weeks time and then just after that the Hats Off Country in Tamworth. The McClymonts have a tour through New South Wales at the end of July and um, up to the Muster, so they're doing just New South Wales for that time. Um, and then we've got the Wolf Brothers doing their mini festival, uh, which is touring in October with Caitlin Shadbolt, Christy Lamb, Troy Kemp and more. There are details for that one on the website. So at the moment, at the top um, in the banner is all the information for the um, This Crazy Life Tour. If you click on that photo, it will then take you into the web page that has all of the information for the tour. Now, looking at upcoming albums, Drake White has announced uh, last week on Twitter that his latest album, Spark, is due to be released on the 19th of August. I am actually wondering if any songs were inspired from his recent uh, tour in Australia for the CMC Rocks in Queensland Festival. We've got Florida Georgia Line who are releasing their Dig Your Roots 
album and that's happening on the 26th of August so mark that one down in your diaries um, obviously that's in time for the Gimpy Music Master no just joking but speaking of which Troy Cassidaly is uh, releasing his album Things I Carry Around in August at the Master um, and then following that early September the book comes out now he has just come back from spending two weeks over in Nashville where he played at the CMA Festival and did some songwriting as well so I'm really excited to see what this album and book is all about and how Troy got to where he is today but that is all for me this week on a final note though if Kicks FM radio is your local radio station please tune in on Friday morning to hear my what's on segment with Crossy I'm really excited about it we've have been having so much fun other than that, have a great week, stay warm, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.